잠시 후 2021학년도 3월 고2 전국연합학력평가 3교시 영어 영역 듣기평가 방송을 시작하겠습니다. 1번 다음을 듣고 여자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Good morning, parents. I'm Jennifer Lawrence, Vice Principal of Green Hill Elementary School. Thank you for being here for the parent-teacher meeting. Before we begin, let me tell you about the field trip next month. The students will be visiting the Children's Natural History Museum. They'll have a great opportunity to explore the different activities there. Today, we'll hand out the field trip permission form to each student, which has all the details, including the schedule and the fees. Please take a look and send it back to us by next Monday. If you have any questions about the trip, please feel free to call us. 2번 대화를 듣고 남자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Chris. Where are you going? I'm going to the library to check out some books. Do you want to come along? Well, I don't often read books these days. I'm busy helping with housework, exercising, and so on. Why don't you try audiobooks then? They're convenient to listen to while you're doing other things. I've never tried it. Do you think it'll work for me? Sure. It's an easy way to enjoy books even if you have a busy schedule. I always listen to a short story when I take a walk. Cool. I guess I could try listening to audiobooks while I do chores. I'm sure you'll enjoy listening to books while dealing with other stuff. Can you recommend some audiobooks to me? I have a few in mind. I'll text you a list later. 3번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hello, Liam. Hello, Emily. I'm wondering if we're having our lesson as scheduled. Sure. Why do you ask? The temperature has gone down a lot lately. I'm afraid I can't surf under these weather conditions. Don't worry. The waves are more important than the temperature in surfing. But I'm still worried. I can't imagine myself going into really cold water. You'll be fine. We have thick wetsuits to keep you warm. Okay. I guess I can try. Ah, one more thing. What is it? I'm not a good swimmer. Would it matter? It'll be okay. Good swimming skills are not really necessary in surfing. I see. Looking forward to your lesson next week. Great. See you then. 4번. 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Honey, come and look. I'm decorating Sam's room for his birthday party. Wow, I like what you put on the wall. It's beautiful. Thanks. I made a heart with flowers. There's a cake on the table. Is that the one Aunt Mary baked for him? Yeah, her cakes are the best. I put three candles on it. Good. Where's the gift we prepared? It's under the table. I tied a ribbon around the box. Nice. Oh, I love this rug on the floor. It has stars on it. It's cute, right? I bought it online. Did you make the balloon dog on the bed? Yes, I did. Sam loves dogs. He does. You did a great job. 
5번 대화를 듣고 여자가 남자에게 부탁한 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Ellie, do you have any idea about our volunteer club's next project? Hmm, last time we knitted hats for babies and sent them to Africa. Yes, we did. How about making eco-friendly soap this time? It helps the environment, and we can give it out to people in need. Good idea. Luckily, we learned how to make soap in science class. Right. I still have the handout about it. Great. You can bring it to our club meeting. It's next Friday, right? Yeah. We can try making soap then. Shall we do it in our club room? I think it'll be better to use the science lab. You're right. Can you go ask Mr. White if we can use it? Sure. I'll do that right away. Thanks. Then I'll find out where we can get the ingredients. 6번 대화를 듣고 남자가 지불할 금액을 고르시오. Honey, we're running out of fine dust masks. Don't we need to order some more? Oh, right. Let's order them on this website. The masks are $2 each and a pack of 10 masks is $15. Then it's cheaper to buy them in packs. Let's get four packs. Okay. We also need some hand wash, right? Yes. Is there any special promotion going on? Let me see. Oh, there is. We can buy three bottles of hand wash for $10. It was originally $5 per bottle. That's a good deal. Let's buy three bottles then. All right. Do we need anything else? No, that's all. Oh, hang on. Look here. If we spend more than $50, we can get a $5 discount. Great. I'll place the order now with my credit card. 7번 대화를 듣고 여자가 취업 면접 특강에 갈수 없는 이유를 고르시오. Hi, Jenny. How's your job interview preparation going? It's not going well. It's not easy doing it by myself. Hmm. Why don't you go to the special lecture on job interviews at the career center? That might help. Do you know when it is? It's this Saturday in the morning from 10 to 12. Oh, no. I'm afraid I can't make it. Oh, you have a part-time job at the library at that time, don't you? No, I quit last month. Actually, I have to take a computer skill test on Saturday. I see. Good luck on your test. Thanks. Do you know if another lecture is coming up? I'm not sure. You should check with the Career Center. Okay, I will. 8번 대화를 듣고 웨스트레이크 펀 런에 관해 언급되지 않은 것을 고르시오. Amy, what are you reading? Our school newsletter. It says our school is holding the West Lake Fun Run. Sounds interesting. When is it? It'll be held on April 17th. I see. How long is the course? It's five kilometers long. Starting at the school, participants will run through Vincent Park and Central Stadium and finish at West Lake. Cool. Why don't we sign up together? Good idea. How much is the entry fee? It's $5 per person. 
The money raised will be used to renovate the school gym. Great! It's so old. It'll be wonderful to have a new gym. I agree. Kuban, sleep under the sea. 관한 다음 내용을 듣고 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Do you ever wonder what happens in the aquarium at night? Pack your pajamas and join us at Sleep Under the Sea. You'll have the opportunity to sleep inside the shark tunnel with sharks and giant fish swimming above you. Our staff will give you a guided tour of the aquarium, including a special visit to our staff-only areas. After the tour, you'll be able to watch a 3D movie about dolphins. To participate in Sleep Under the Sea, children must be aged five and up, and all children under 15 must be accompanied by an adult. Dinner and breakfast will be provided during the Sleep Under the Sea experience. For more information, visit our website at www.sealifeaquarium.org. 10번. 다음 표를 보면서 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 주문할 자전거 헬멧을 고르시오. Honey, what are you looking at on the internet? I'm looking for a bike helmet for Jason. There's a crack in his old helmet. Oh, I didn't know that. Let's pick one together then. What's our priority? I guess it's weight. What about you? Same here. Considering Jason's age, it should be under 600 grams. I agree. I think this one is too expensive, though. I don't want to spend more than $70. Okay, let's choose from these three, then. Do you think LED lights are necessary? Yes, it'll be safer to have them when riding at night. You're right. Now we have two options left. Do you think our son will like this one? I don't think so. He doesn't like yellow. That's right. Let's order the other one. 11번. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Lydia, you said you were going camping with your family to Mount Bluestone during the winter vacation. How was it? We couldn't make it because of the heavy snow. We camped indoors at our house instead. That's cool. I wonder where the tent was set up. 12번 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Mr. Johnson, do you have a minute? I need your opinion on the project I'm doing. I'd love to discuss that with you, but I'm expecting a visitor in 10 minutes. Is 10 minutes enough? I am afraid it'll take longer than that. Shall I come back later? 13번. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Dad, I'm home. Where's Max? He's sleeping in his house. I took him to the vet this morning. He hasn't been eating well lately. What did the vet say? She said there's nothing wrong with him. He just needs more exercise. More exercise? We take him out for a walk regularly. That's true, but we don't walk him every day. The vet said he needs at least an hour of exercise every day. Oh, 
I didn't know that. I think we should exercise him every day from now on. I agree. What if we all take turns doing it? Good idea. Your mom and I will do it on weekdays. You're busy with your schoolwork during the weekdays. Hi, Tara. What are you looking at? Hi, Dan. I'm reading a post about an online debate competition. Oh, it sounds interesting. Are you going to participate? I want to, but it's a team competition. Why don't we make a team and enter together? You're a great debater. Thanks. I'm flattered. But debating online is new to me. I'm not sure if I can do it well. Don't worry. Everything is basically the same, except it's taking place online. You'll get used to it with a little bit of practice. I see. I'll enter with you then. When's the competition? It's a month away. We have plenty of time to prepare. I guess we need to practice online, right? But my laptop isn't working at the moment. No problem. You can do it on your smartphone. Lisa and Kevin are reporters for the school newspaper. They decided to interview Mr. Jackson, the new history teacher, for the next issue. Kevin suggests that they take a photo of him to put in their interview article. Lisa knows that Kevin is good at drawing caricatures and that he often draws teachers and students. She has seen the caricature of Mr. Jackson that Kevin drew. So she thinks that it'll be better to put the caricature in the article instead of a photo because caricatures can be more appealing than photos. Lisa wants to suggest to Kevin that they use his work. In this situation, what would Lisa most likely say to Kevin? 16번부터 17번은 두번 들려줍니다. 16번과 17번 다음을 듣고 물음에 답하시오. Hello, class. Let's continue to talk about different cultures around the world. People celebrate the new year in various ways. In Spain, it's customary to eat 12 grapes at midnight on New Year's Eve. Each grape represents good luck for one month of the coming year. In Denmark, people greet the new year by throwing old plates and glasses against the doors of family and friends. They believe it'll get rid of the bad spirits. They also stand on chairs and jump off them together at midnight to leap into January. In Mexico, residents carry empty suitcases around the block. Mexicans believe that doing so will bring travel and adventure in the coming year. In Greece, an onion is traditionally hung on the front door of homes on New Year's Eve as a symbol of rebirth. On New Year's Day, parents wake their children by tapping them on the head with the onion. Now let's watch some video clips of these unique traditions. Hello, class. Let's continue to talk about different cultures around the world. People celebrate the new year in various ways. In Spain, it's customary to eat 12 grapes at midnight on New Year's Eve. Each grape represents good luck for one month of the coming year. 
In Denmark, people greet the new year by throwing old plates and glasses against the doors of family and friends. They believe it'll get rid of the bad spirits. They also stand on chairs and jump off them together at midnight to leap into January. In Mexico, residents carry empty suitcases around the block. Mexicans believe that doing so will bring travel and adventure in the coming year. In Greece, an onion is traditionally hung on the front door of homes on New Year's Eve as a symbol of rebirth. On New Year's Day, parents wake their children by tapping them on the head with the onion. Now let's watch some video clips of these unique traditions. 16번 남자가 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것은 17번 언급된 나라가 아닌 것은 이제 듣기 문제가 끝났습니다.